It's all daily routine, no. Just relax. Let go of all your fears and worries and doubts. This is the time for you to connect with the source and let go of all your emotions that you're holding on to. So take a deep breath in. Imagine golden light going into your nostrils and into your body, throughout your body. Clearing away all the negativity from your body. And as you release it, let it flow into a pot at the side. So breathe in three or four more times. Enjoy this energy going round the body. As you're letting go of all the negativity that's trapped in your body. Then just imagine yourself at a waterfall. Use your five senses. Hear the birds. Smell the green grass, the fresh grass. Feel the waterfall. Just step in it and get a cleanse. Become one with the energy of the waterfall. Don't need to taste the waterfall unless you fancy it. But feel really one with this area. Then open your hands out towards the sky. And ask for the energy of the waterfall into your hands. As it builds up, imagine that the side is a transparent box. Pour all the energy from the waterfall into the transparent box. Then imagine the wind's energy. Feel the wind's energy around your hands, building up in your hands. Asking for the energy of the wind. And when it gets too heavy, pour this into the transparent box. Then you see the sun is shining. Feel the energy on your body of the sun. As you feel one with the sun. Ask for the energy to build up in your hands. And then pour that into the transparent box. Then you see a raging fire. Imagine the raging fire is by the side of the stream where the waterfall is. With all big logs. Go and feel the warmth of this energy. Ask for the energy of the fire to build up in your hands and pour that into the transparent box then just imagine yourself flying or bounding towards the sea a bit of a sea storm feel the energy of the sea storm building up in your hands as it really gurgitates the bottom of the sea and cleanses the inner parts of your emotions Feel the energy of this and go back to the transparent box and pour that into the transparent box. Then, as it starts to become night, you see the moon in the sky shining bright as a full moon. Feel the emotions leaving your body. Ask for the energy of the moon to build up in your hands. And then pour that into the transparent box. By the side of the waterfall there's a big oak tree. Go and sit with the oak tree. And imagine yourself like an oak tree. Ground yourself with deep roots going out of the bottom of your feet. Any worries and fears, give them to the earth as you pass them through your feet into the, into the ground. Feel as you become one with the earth and with everything around it the waterfall and everything feel as you start to become one ask for heaven's energy to come into your leaves or into your head and flow through your body ask for unconditional love to come into your heart and flow through your body as now you become one with yourself Repeat in your head, I love myself ten times, I love myself. This is getting the connection that your body needs to become one again. 
and ten times I am peace I am peace feel as the energy of peace is flowing through your body as you become peace and you become love I am peace then imagine the energy as you step inside the transparent box feel the energy of all the different elements and you being one as well adding to the energy feel the source coming from your heart going straight into the ground as you become one with everything we're going to put in some lovely words to get your vibrations flowing again abundance unconditional love peace harmony anything you feel that you would like to bring peace to you can mention at this moment then imagine yourself as all the ties to the past all the ties to the future and all the ties to the people and the places that you have been to are being cut away by your soul feel them from your back and your stomach and your heart all the emotional ties that's holding you and causing you to not be able to relax as your mind overworks feel this wonderful energy as you release yourself from all the burdens and all the worries and the fears send unconditional love and peace down all of these lines to all your families and friends places you've gone to all the souls that are still trapped to try and learn lessons on your behalf ask all your souls all the aspects of your souls to come back as one as you take your power back as you now are powerful and not feeding anybody around you to give you lessons anymore as you're becoming one with the source feel out the bottom of your feet spreading your energy to everything in the world as you merge and become one with everything now you start to flow with nature's energy and flow with everything around you as you merge you can feel that you're part of everything and so no longer a separate no longer illusions will appear as you're flowing with the energy that can attract anything money is energy unconditional love all these wonderful things are part of you now and so we just stay one and at peace imagine inside as you ignite the source that's within you feel the energy expand all throughout your body throughout your feet and through your head into all your aura around you cleansing all your aura of all the ideas and illusions and thoughts that you've held on to cleansing all the way around you then imagine white light sealing check all the aura to make sure that it's all nicely sealed and there's no cracks as you fix them then we put a big white light around us like a bubble around the beautiful energy that we created then we imagine a waterfall around so that any negativity will be cleansed before it gets to us know that we don't need to attach to people anymore we don't need to worry or fear as we now become one in the source's energy any time that you want to just have a quick cleanse just imagine yourself stepping back into the box let go all your emotions into the pot outside and step in and, and get the cleanse in once more any times throughout the day that you feel that you're not flowing imagine yourself flowing down the river as you become one once more as you allow the flow of the energy to take you on your path just surrender and allow now your path to show as you're part of everything and now you will start to enjoy life as you feel this wonderful energy flowing through you attracting abundance attracting unconditional love attracting the source and peace into your life just relax and enjoy for the moment this energy feel all around you as you're part of everything as you become one feel 
all the joy that you can now have through being this energy. Thank you for sharing. in ties the reason we cut ties is to let go of the emotional ties that we hold on to from people we meet from places from situations from insecurities from problems that we have attached to to learn in this life so cutting the emotional ties will help you to let go of all the negative energy that's feeding your body and triggering your insecurities or worries and fears and getting the brain to overwork. So regular cutting of ties is very important because it's not just the people, it's also the places, the objects that we actually connect to. Because everything we are attaching to, we are learning from. And by cutting ties, we release the illusions and the fears that are stopping us from being one with the source. So just relax. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. Deep breath in and a deep breath out. Do another couple more in your own time. Do not worry about how you're breathing in or out. Just know that you're doing it is enough. Good. You'll feel lighter already as you've been letting go of those emotions and worries. So then go to your heart area and feel the cords from your heart that's attached to all the people and all the situations throughout your lifetime. And imagine that these can be cut whether you're using scissors or bolt cutters or even asking your soul to cut the ties so that you can let go of all this emotional burden that you've been carrying around on your body you can do it individually or you can do it as one big swell swoop as you cut the ties you can even trace some of the lines to find who is giving you the most emotions but also remember that it's what other people are attached to also is feeding your lines and that's why sometimes we feel a bit low or a bit high or because we're feeding off other people's emotions and then when we phone our friends up we find out that it's them that's going through I'm not saying this is a bad thing but when we have too much of negativity feeding the body is stopping the body from healing itself because it's concentrating more on the problems and the lessons than it is of keeping the body balanced so once you've cut the ties to all the people throughout your life then just imagine unconditional love and peace or white light going down these lines this will stop people from reconnecting for a little while also when you meet people I am love I am peace is a good way to make sure that you ignite themselves to be on the same energy as you and so not to attach to you also and give you this energy we're not talking the unconditional love or the soul connection that'll always be there you won't be cutting that it's just the emotional ties that's feeding your negative energy which will then come in physical form now we're going to work on the past life so in the middle of your back is energy cords to your past life so imagine the soul cutting these cords and sending unconditional love and peace down these lines these are ideas thoughts illusions that come with us every day each morning when we wake up we feel 
our insecurities, our fears, our worries, what that we've experienced in the past will come forward. And it's only when we attach or start thinking about them that we bring them forth to experience in our present life. So cutting your ties to the past and living in the moment is very important. Once you've done that, also know that all the way around your body, from your feet to your knees, to your stomach, to your heart, to your throat, to your third eye, also could be future vibrations, future chords. Fear of the future is another thing, another conditioning that we, we put on ourselves. Stops us moving forward. For example, if your right foot felt like it had a pulling sensation, it might be that you're frightened to step forward to do with material or to do with money or to do with just stepping forward in the future and fears that you have. We sometimes think also the left side is the female and also the spiritual and sometimes the right side is male and material. This gives us the balance. So you can go through all the different areas and check and cut all the ties. So just imagine a big sweep of of a knife or scissors cutting all the ties that are connected to all these different areas. Then imagine white light ignited near your heart going through your head into your aura. Feel the white light cleansing any illusions, fears and doubts that we have in the aura that is trapped, waiting for us to deal with. Feel all the people you've touched to as well being cleansed as your aura is expanding with pure white light. Then seal it in white light around and a waterfall so that when you come into contact with people you are not absorbing any more negativity. New energy, new you. Take five deep breaths and as you breathe out, imagine all your worries, fears and negativity leaving the body. So breathe in and breathe out. Imagine a pure energy from the heavens pouring down into your head going throughout your body as it goes through your feet deep into the ground as you become one with the source then imagine unconditional love being poured through your heart throughout your body as you become one as you do this say ten times in your head I love myself I love myself And then, ten times, I am peace, I am peace. Then, we are going to cleanse the body as we prepare to receive the source. So just imagine yourself at the sea, use your five senses, feel the sand, Hear the wind blowing. Listen to the sea as it washes backwards and forwards. Smell the sea water. You don't need to taste. Just feel part of the sea. As you sit there Give all your emotions to the sea. Let go of everything that you have to do and just feel drawn to the sea. Ask for the energy of the sea to come forth into your body and around your body as you feel the flow of the sea inside of you. Then we ask for the energy of the wind. Feel the energy of the wind going through your body as you relax and feel one. 
Then we see the sun is shining. Feel the sun's rays on your body as it cleanses the whole of your body. Feel the energy flowing through you as it cleanses your body. Right next to you is a raging fire with big logs. Ask for the energy of the fire and feel the energy of the fire as it goes through your body and around. Then you notice that the sea is starting to get a little bit stormy. Ask for the energy of the sea to flow through your body as you cleanse your body. Next to the side you see a waterfall. Imagine yourself next to the waterfall and feel the energy of the waterfall. Feel as it cleanses your soul and cleanses your body as you feel the energy flowing through you. Last but not least, there is a big tree next to the waterfall. Imagine yourself as a tree. Feel yourself ground into the earth as you become one like a tree. Feel the sun on your leaves shining bright and feel unconditional love coming into your heart like the bark. Feel as you become one with a tree. Now imagine ties from the past from your back. Feel as your soul cuts those ties to your past knowing that you no longer are being pulled back by the past. Send love and peace down these lines as you free yourself from the past. In the present moment, imagine all the people that you're connected to, all the people emotionally attached to. This is not unconditional love line. This is all the emotional lines of all the fears and worries of other people's and yourself. As you attach to people to learn lessons, free yourself up from these lessons by cutting the ties and send love and peace down the lines so that your friends and family and every object you come into and the places that you've visited you are being freed from those energies and also from the stomach area feel as the whole of your body feels about the future in your stomach area is just the emotional stuff to do with the future but all over your body you might feel pulling sensations to do with the future where you're frightened to step forward in life or you're worried a little bit about the future cut these emotional ties and send peace and love down these so they're not to attach again now we're going to deal with problems so in the middle of the room is this wonderful big box I want you to put all your problems, all your fears everything into this box all the illusions that you have that you can't do things in life all the things that, that you wanted in life but you feel that you can't have put these worries and fears into this box notice that the angels are dealing with these problems and will sort them out and they will get done as soon as possible any insecurities you have left on the body imagine going into the box Imagine all these energies, all these fears, all the stuff that you've been holding on to that you don't need. We're going to learn now to not separate from the source. Once we worry and fear and doubt is when we separate. We are abundant and so do not allow anything to detach you from being abundant or being one with everything. If you See in front of you a big picture board with all the images. Put all the images of everything that you've been frightened of. All the worries, all the fears, all the doubts. All the situations in your life where you didn't understand why they happened or were you attracted to learn from. Explode them all the way as you free yourself up from all the emotional items that we've held on to. All the situations from our past that have stopped us from moving forward and vibrating. See them all exploding, all the situations that have brought us worries and fears. Forgive for the experience that we've created. Feel the pain that we've held on to and let it go. And then imagine yourself 
asking for your soul to take your power back. See all the elements of your soul that's all to do with all the different places that you've been and visited, all the people that you've still left your soul to deal with problems and situations. Ask for your soul to come back as one as you feel the power coming back with your soul. Cleanse your soul with unconditional love and white light. And so all the different aspects, all the different parts of your soul bring back into one as it steps one into you. Feel the energy of you not giving out any energy to be used against you or to give you lessons or worries or fears. Just remember that, that what you created for the moment you can change. So in the moment is all that you want to worry about. In this moment you can change your life. You can see the opportunities. You can create. The past is just but has made you into the wonderful person you are. The future is yet to be experienced. So bring yourself back to the moment and feel the love and the unconditional energy of this moment. Surrender and allow your soul path to show. Realize that it's all for a reason. So whatever you've created now, you can change. By surrendering and allowing your path to show, you are telling your soul to guide you once more on your journey to help you to get rid of these illusions of what you perceive you're meant to be doing or what people think that you should be doing. But now when you surrender and allow the flow of the source through your body, you allow your path to show and just experience. We will then start to see the big picture that will bring us peace and then you become the new energy, the new you. Imagine that this moment you are a new body, a new energy, and that every moment afterwards you're going to carry on this new energy. This will cleanse the past and cleanse any vibrations that is not helping you on your journey. Now we're going to put some new vibrations in. So imagine abundance flowing through your body. Ask for health to flow through your body wealth and unconditional love is flowing through your body this will start attracting new vibrations and new situations to bring you peace to your life now we're going to merge with the source feel the energy of the source that's connected to everything become one with everything look for the opportunities to be and flow the source so imagine yourself by the sea step into the sea and just enjoy as the sea takes you backwards and forwards as you chill and relax and floating in the sea feel your energy leaving your body and connecting to everything trees plants people new beginnings as you start to merge one with the sea and with everything now you're connected to the source no longer are you being swaying backwards and forwards, you are just one with everything. So imagine this energy inside of you igniting the source within and feel as it grows inside your body and gets bigger and bigger and starts to go through your whole of your body from your feet all the way up to your head you feel this source energy as it's been ignited Feel it going through your head, into your aura and cleansing your aura, sealing the aura as you become one with everything. Now you are one with yourself and one with everything. Now you can be of service. Sharing by being one again, you will allow others to enjoy the energy that you share. Enjoy the experience of the source as you now see opportunities and you now flow in the source you will have no fears and doubts as you start on your journey to just experience that which is the source that which brings you peace will bring happiness 
as you just flow and enjoy life. Realise you have a part to play by just staying one with the source. So any time that you want to feel this energy, just imagine this last bit of this situation. Imagine the source ignited in you each day and growing and seeding you and protecting you as you become one. You then start to realise that you'll start to ignite in others the same energy as like attracts like and see how they start to shine and give you information as they help you on your journey. Now that you are a new you and new energy, just enjoy the experience and thank you for sharing. Moment of peace. Cut the ties to the past. Know that the past is but an emotional energy helping you to become a new energy today. So just imagine a cord from your back being cut and peace being sent down the line. Now imagine a cord to your future. Your future you have free will to create, you are already on the path and so opportunities to show you how to be peace in the future will show. So cut the emotional ties that you have of worries and fears about the future. Then we'd like you to cut the ego. Just imagine you're cutting the energy of the ego that is making you feel as though you're an individual cutting you off from all around you that's stopping you from the opportunities of flowing in let go of everything fears doubts shames the way your life has been created to bring peace to life we must let go of that which is not flowing on our bodies we have insecurities and fears that we've held on to negativity that we don't need anymore so just imagine your body releasing all of those letting go as you put it all into the water allowing your body to become peace you are where you're meant to be at the moment so just surrender to the moment. Look at what you're grateful for. Think about all the things that are good in your life. We're not saying what's positive or negative because they're just energies that will bring balance to your life. We are looking at what you're grateful for. What makes you happy, what brings joy to your life. Being an open vessel of peace is a way to allow all that you experience just be in experience and by the experience you learn to have no attachments but the big picture is that you will always have peace in your life if you do not attach to that which is not peace allow everything to flow through you and don't fear doubt or worry see them as just signs know that you're being supported and guided by doing this you're allowing yourself to take charge your soul has chosen your path and so to be in the moment is to release yourself from all that which isn't flowing imagine yourself as a flowing river just feel the support of the river surrender to the water and allow the water to take you around the rocks or over the rocks take you down the path as you go one with nature as you feel one with everything you start to see the opportunities presenting the information that you need so that everything that you ever desire can come to you for you are part of everything and so by being part of everything you allow which you have not flowing at the moment to come to you feel the joy of the journey feel creative 
in your opportunities. Know that that which is peace will flow to you and experience. Know that life is flowing with you. Just feel the energy of the water as it's playing its part and you are sharing in the experience. Release all that you have that you think you need or want for nothing is needed as you are being guided to where to go. In your head, now say on the journey, I love myself, I am peace. I am love, I am peace. Repeat a few times as you feel the energies, as your body and soul becomes one with you in the water, as you're flowing. You know now that when you flow in this nature and you become one with the nature that everything comes to you. No longer do you search all that you are now is an opportunity to experience, to enjoy the journey. Remember to play your part, be an open vessel and by you being peace you are igniting others and your environment and so you're planting the seed. If people do not, at the present time, understand you or want to criticize you, no, that's not you that they're criticizing. You are just reflecting to them what they need at this time. And just know that if you have an insecurity, this is an opportunity to let go and to be more at peace to that which you have vibrated before. So see, every moment, every problem has just an opportunity to let go of that which is not vibrating. You can imagine not even you there if you want to do it that way. Or you can imagine a time when you see a problem of a time when you didn't have a problem. But by just anything that comes your way, just put in a box or put in the river and allow it to go on its journey so it will not be a part of you. For it is only in the attachment of a problem that it becomes a problem. For as a vessel, nothing can vibrate at the same level. So just know that you are a higher vibration and nothing bad can attach to you. Only if you allow it. So play your part. Be one with everything. See everything as a two-way experience. Vibrate the level of the pure water flowing down the river and then eventually you become one with the sea and everything then flows to you as you're the open vessel of peace. Feel the times that you were peaceful and balanced in life when you found magic moments where you felt one with yourself and just enjoyed that you are now that vessel. You no need uh, to please or to do anything but be peace and see how other people around you start to change their vibration to match yours and then you'll see a new world as you merge with everything everything will be highlighted that is peace you'll suddenly see all the parts that everything objects people are playing their part good or bad or a plant it still needs the time to nurture to grow by planting the seed you're giving it the opportunity to blossom to become one with itself it bends with the wind it may be a time when it feels and it's not beautiful but always it has inside of it its part to play become that entity become that energy of peace and know that you will always become one with yourself and everything The awakening. Just relax. Take this moment to truly find peace within yourself as we open the source within us all. Take a few moments to create peace by saying, I am peace, I am joy, 
I am the source energy and I am awakened to a new energy. Imagine by your heart the source and energy that is pure of nature being released as you share and merge with this energy. You feel the energy expanding and cleansing all the energies of the body back to the source. As this new energy merges with your body, you feel the unconditional love and peace vibrating and changing the flow of your body. As it cleanses, you feel alive and open to the magic it holds. Each vibrational beat of your heart creating a new energy, new body, new connection to the source. No longer do you feel separate or a body. You feel part of a bigger picture as you evolve into a new spiritual soul. Your energy expanding through all the parts of your body as it changes the structure of your body to flow in this amazing energy. Go to the areas of your body. Start from the top and just feel the change of energy at the top of your head. Move down to your eyes, your third eye, and feel as this new energy flows there. Then flow to your throat and feel there as this energy is changing. Then to the heart area as you feel the new love and this amazing energy flowing in your heart, pumping all around your body as you become one with the source. Just spend a moment to go to your stomach area, then into your legs and finally see yourself in this lovely energy. You feel drawn to others in the group, in the world as the new energy is emerging with from everyone from everything as we become a flow of life a true essence is emerging of a new energy new joy as we align ourselves with the portal within us for everything we share now vibrates the source energy as we let go and surrender to the source we become a new awakened being we are free to enjoy and share this energy as we ignite in all the portal to open to be shared by the world. Just let this energy expand to all your friends, enemies and people may like to share with no thoughts or reasons for doing so. As we are now the new source energy, we will just be. Let yourself be guided to play your part in sharing and surrender to this new energy as you feel the love flowing through your body. Problem box. Breathe in and out five times and let go of all your fears and worries, all the problems, illusions and insecurities that you're holding on to. Create your problem box. Imagine that you have a box, it could be a wooden box cardboard box it doesn't matter what it is you can either see the color of the box if you want to create your box this box is going to help you to let go and to deal with all of the problems that you've been holding on to so as you breathe in and out let go of all your negativity all your problems and fears and imagine the energy going into the box just the intention is enough to let go of what you're holding on to at the moment. Even if you come across people, places that you don't feel happy and content or joy from, it could be that they have negativity attached. 
and so just imagine those people and places going into the box to let go of that which is vibrating an energy that will affect your life even when you sabotage your life or even when you think of negative thoughts about yourself imagine those going into the box also know that everything you put in the box that your higher self, your soul or the angels whoever you feel is powerful enough to deal with these problems and help you out will resolve and sort them out for you this also tells the brain that you've dealt with the problem it means it's not going to overwork to try and clear out or attract people or situations so that you will let go of these problems this is also good for when you meet people or when you're doing healing or some places that are negative we absorb automatically energies vibrations and negativity which triggers our problems and insecurities and then we run with it so just imagine letting yourself go of all these worries and fears and put them in the box you can also imagine yourself cleansing in nature to help the process I love imagining myself under the waterfall anything that you feel even I am love I am peace repeat in your head will change the vibration and let go of that which you're holding on to so definitely good before you sleep and also in the morning when you get up let go because at night we dream emotional stuff problems and situations to deal with and so it's always good to let go of any energies that we're holding on to I use this regular and it has always helped me to stop the brain from overthinking there is going to be situations that's going to occur and it's only our attachment to our worries or our fears or the illusion of what may happen is what's going to cause us to overthink about it get back to the moment and understand that in this moment you create your life and if you're holding on to anything that is stopping you from flow then it's time to let go picture board just imagine that you've put a big picture board on your wall with loads of pictures of your life these are images insecurities and illusions or fears that you're holding on to at the moment you can do it either individually and just do one picture that's causing you problems at the moment or doesn't feel right or you can put in the whole life of pictures or you can go from naught to 10 and 10 to 20 20 to 30 if you want to do it individually it doesn't matter what just imagine that all these pictures are on the board don't be worried about going into each picture just know that they're all up there all the illusions all the fears that you're holding on to and so imagine them all exploding away imagine that you are a new energy a new start and so now you've just taken away all your illusions and fears and worries that you've been holding on to once you see them all exploding away or you can imagine setting fire to them or whichever way you feel they all disappear forgive yourself for the experience feel the negativity that you're holding on to and let go letting go is very important and you're telling the body that you do not need to hold on to what is stopping you from moving forward another way is if there's a particular insecurity that really affects you we can send unconditional love to it to see the bigger picture to why we have attracted it or what it is 
that we're holding on to. Another good way is to actually think of a time or a good time in your life that supersedes it. So if you're thinking at the moment you have no money, think of the time that somebody gave you money or you got money at that right time when you needed it or when you were quite rich. By doing this you balance the insecurity of fear and it also replaces it. Because it's often when we hold on to or we fear or we worry or attach to, it then starts to manifest. We start to attract situations, people to tell us that we haven't got money. Um, bills to come through at the wrong time. We are then starting to see more of the problems than we are of the opportunity to rectify the problems. So using a picture board is very good for learning to let go and also to get rid of what you're holding on to. Let it go. I feel this is one of the hardest things to do. It's like allowing the energy of the source to flow through your body. It's about surrendering and allowing who you are to show. To be happy with who you are and to stop searching, stop trying so hard Stop looking for a perfect world. Stop saying that in the future everything will be alright. Stop thinking that once you've done something, peace will prevail. Peace is in the moment that you become peace. And so letting go of all the conditioning, all the fears and worries, is one of the hardest. Get back to the moment. If in this moment everything evolves, your journey is about just the journey, not the destination. You've already probably decided on what you are going to do before you come here. And the hardest part is letting go so that we can then become one again with everybody. We also need to have a bit of faith and believe in ourselves. Believe that everything's going to work out. When we learn that we're abundant already, then we're not trying to be abundant, which is a lack. When we understand that we're the perfect energy, and so by resonating that, we attract the source that's in everything the good parts of life and anything that we perceive is bad could also be changing our direction to something good so when we surrender and allow the source to flow through us we're allowing to be who we are to merge with the source get back to nature let go of all your fears and worries in nature let it absorb away all that it is the stopping you from even trying in life when we merge with the source we automatically let go we automatically let go of the fears and doubts allow the big picture to emerge of what it is that we're here if we don't know our part to play then allow it to show this is the hardest part Letting go so you can flow. Like down a river. Instead of swimming upstream, 
just allow the water to take you. Know that the water will take you safely in the right direction and on the right path. It is then that you become the path. Then you can feel the new energy that you've become. Then you'll see the part that everybody plays. You'll see the beauty in others. You'll stop trying and searching. You'll just be. So let go of that which separates you from the source. The illusions and doubts. Anything negativity is just trying to balance your life. Or trying to teach you that you're separating. And so get back to the moment. Get back to who you are. By letting go of that which has separated you. Taking your power back is so important. So many of us give away our power in a lot of ways um, through our fears and worries and doubts. So it's really important throughout the day to take your power back. It's so easy to absorb other people's negativity, thoughts and ideas and worries. And there's more and more of us becoming empaths. More and more of us are actually finding it hard to take our power back. We give our power to people to do things to us, to upset us. And so really taking your power back and, and being in, in improving your self-esteem, um, getting your balance within your body is the main reason that you will be able to deal with more things in life. So this is a very good meditation for you. Take your power back. It is very important that from time to time you pull back all your energies from all the problems, the situations and people that you have come in contact because you could be feeding other people to give you lessons in life and this can cause you to tap into your insecurities and see things and be paranoid about situations that you have had to learn from so just take a moment to breathe in and breathe out and let go of all your fears and your worries everything you've got to do today anything that is on your mind just let go for the moment as you breathe in now imagine golden energy going around your body opening up all your senses and allowing you to bring back the energy that you are attached to. Go to the heart and feel the golden energy in the heart and feel all the lines that you're connected to, all the places, all the people that are feeding you negative energy. We're not on about the unconditional love lines, we're just on about the emotional lines. So trace any of the pictures to see of situations, of environments, of places, of people that you are attached to, or maybe even problems or scenarios that you are still vibrating towards. Take your time and just imagine that you forgive and feel and let go of that situation. See a part of your soul attached to that situation coming back to your body. As it comes back to the body, feel white light cleansing the soul to bring it back to your one. Do this as a complete. You can imagine all your souls coming back with white light shining with them. Or you can go individually, but you will need to pause the tape at the moment and individually go through all the different lines and do what I've just said. As you bring your soul back as one, feel the power of you becoming one again. Feel the abundance in you. Feel that you're part of the source once more. See yourself in nature 
and feel the energies of all the different elements, the sun, the moon's energy, the tree, the sea storm, a waterfall, a tree, anything that you feel drawn to bring back and feel the energy going out of your feet down into the earth. If there's any more problems that comes to your mind, just imagine feeding these problems down the line into the source to be cleansed and feel the power as you are one once more. Feel how powerful you feel in the knowledge that you that you are one again and a complete person and don't have to give your power away. Pure Vibe To feel the pure vibration we must first cleanse ourselves. So just relax, let yourself go and let go of all of the emotional energy that you're holding on to. If you want to imagine it flowing from your body into a river, that's fine, or into an imaginary box, that will also do. So just imagine a waterfall. Imagine the feeling of the waterfall energy flowing throughout your body and cleansing and letting go of all the negativity. Then we imagine the sun's energy flowing through the body from the top to the bottom all the way through. Then imagine the moon's energy shining and flowing through the energy of the moon as it cleanses the whole of the body. Then imagine the wind's energy as you feel that flowing through the body and out through the feet. Imagine yourself at a raging fire. Feel the warmth of the fire as it flows the energy of the fire through your body as you feel nice and cleansed. Last but not least, imagine an oak tree in front of you. Feel the energy of the oak tree flowing through your body. And then I want you to imagine deep root coming out of your feet and deep down into the soil. Feel the roots as they reconnect to the source. Surrender that you're part of the source. Feel the energy of surrendering like you're flowing down a river. Just allow the river and the universe and your soul to guide you. Then imagine lovely abundance coming through your body. Lovely health as it fixes all your body and gets it realigned in the source. Wealth flowing through your body as you're part of everything. The joy of living and experiencing life. Feel the source flowing through your body. And last, enjoy unconditional love vibrating through your body as you feel one with everything. You are now a new energy. Every moment thereafter you feel this new energy as you are one with everything. You feel the joy of experiencing this. In every moment you can feel this pure vibration throughout your body. Know that whatever you do in life you can feel the joy of doing it. Be creative. Look to what makes you feel good about what you do. What you can create in the moment will be shared in the future. Let the passion flow as you share all these ideas and thoughts and guidance from the source for others to share with you and build your energy up. Merge with the feeling of joy. Just feel any moment that you've enjoyed life to spark it off. Just feel that passion and that feeling of being one with everything. 
if you want to sing or be creative in writing or creative in drawing anything just allow this to happen allow that you play your part in whatever you do see the new world as you are part of everything creating and sharing as you feel the joy of being and playing your part in whatever you do whether it's simple whether it's complicated it doesn't matter you're just going to go with the flow and feel as your part that you play makes a big difference see the beauty in all and know that your part is showing this beauty as you go ask the source for guidance say source guide us feel the messages coming towards you the thoughts the ideas don't hold on to them I know they feel good and I know you'll see signs around but let them evolve into bigger pictures so you might see a pound coming today and a million pound as you put it back into the river and let it build you might see the opportunities of love and see as that love grows even bigger as you share with the person and share with the life of love in every opportunity you have to feel love to be love to share love so imagine putting any messages back in the river or get excited by the thought of it growing and more messages coming as you see it evolves into bigger messages if you want to make a note of each message then you have played your part by sharing it by writing it down you allow it to come in confirmation of why the message has been given to you enjoy this opportunity the signs all around you to surrender and know that they will come to you feel it in your body and the challenges to a new you to peace and harmony I love you world say out aloud just be the love so others can share as you feel the love of life running through your body now as you flow with it you know that you've surrendered to the moment and you know in this moment opportunities guidance from your soul is waiting for you are the perfect vessel now to receive give any thoughts that are not of love to the angels or don't feel right in your heart for you are a perfect energy as your body will release the last bits of insecurities any ideas that come that do not seem to be filled with love let them go and know that they will be taken away by the angels now you are a new energy new love you are ignited in the flow of life so enjoy the pure vibe feeling